Big wheels rolling, big wheels rolling, moving on. Big wheels rolling, gotta keep them going. Big wheels rolling, moving on. The white line is the lifeline to a nation. And men like Will and Sonny make it move. He's pronounced this Glasgow G G L A S G O W Glasgow, something like that. There ain't no, yeah, Glasgow, Kentucky. We're just down the road. We're actually at a Walmart once again. We're at a Walmart, but we're just down the road to our pickup. So we're gonna go on over there. We're gonna get that pickup right now. My understanding, I'm going to uh, Little Rock with it, so I want to go get this load. I think there's two drops in Little Rock or something, is what I, I I'm I'm being told anyway. Well, this is dangerous here. I gotta use my spot mirror to get out of here. Yeah. Not a problem. Thank God for spot mirrors, right? We're going to make a right up here. place to park you can always depend on Walmart most of the time sometimes not all the time but once in a while a steep hill I'm glad I'm empty but we're gonna go on down here and get this load and head to Arkansas. <laughs> Got a motorcyclist behind me without a shirt on. And I heard if a bug hits him, huh? You think maybe the wind took the shirt from him? He ain't trying to go around me, though. Motorcycle, would you stay behind a truck? Especially when there's a lane you can go around. I must be using my trailer for for a shield. Being he ain't got a shirt on, right? Kind of funny. Would you go without a shirt on? He ain't going very fast. <laughs> I have to tell you though, that's pretty funny. Born to be wild without a shirt on. <laughs> he just wanting the wind to hit his uh Hairy skin, huh? I don't know why it's wanting me to do a left. I gotta do a right to get there, but for some reason it's wanting me to go left. We ain't gonna do that. I know where this place is. But for some reason Rhonda's wanting me to do a left.
and they can move pretty fast. If not, we're going to be here for a while. US 68. down the road <coughs> seven tenths of a mile Barnard Downey Drive they even got their own drive half a mile yep I see her And this is basically the only R and R Donnelly you cannot park overnight. Cause they got a big sign in there that says no overnight parking. It's the only one. The rest of them don't mind, you know. All right, pick them up truck. Give me enough room to get around you. I hate to hit you with my trailer, man. We got her. I just had to squeeze in there. All trucks. Yep, second entrance. This is it. R and R shipping and receiving entrance. Uh, is that car crossing that center line? You better get over there, Bubba. I get nervous when they cross that center line like that. I have no place to go but off the road. And he's still gonna get my trailer. I can't get it up completely off the road. As long as he doesn't hit me, he can hit the trailer. I don't care. I just don't want him hit the truck. See, trucks, no overnight parking. It's the only one that I know that you can't park overnight. Of course, we're not parking. <laughs> but if you come in here tired, you, you gotta leave. See a couple trucks sitting in docks. Yeah. It's my second time here. I hope they don't have a big weight. And I hope I don't have to sit in the dock too long. Pull over to the right and kind of get out of everybody's way. I'm gonna run in. I don't remember which door you go in, really. I gotta figure that one out. I think it's that one, if I remember right. We're gonna park it right here, folks. We will be right back. Oh, we're in Franklin, Kentucky. We're right at the state line. I had to scale my load. See exactly how much I weigh there. Yep. 
a crowded up pilot. Oh yeah. Let these guys do their thing and then we're gonna go get our skill ticket and we're gonna eat. Then we're on our way to Little Rock. Oh yeah. Then as my little little buddies do their thing. But we'll be right back, y'all. here to love like walking through a maze of trucks they had a couple places up front but I don't like parking up front I really don't I prefer to park in the back that's where the grass is besides I need the exercise oversized Now he'll take up two spots. Yeah. I guess he ain't got a choice though, right? Anyway, let's go inside. Check. I'm nosy. I like coming out, checking out everything. Scoping it out. There ain't much going on. back to the truck and uh, get ready to go to bed I want to get up early I really do want to blow by uh, Memphis before uh, rush hour of course it don't really matter you know the shop is over there Loves. 
like any other truck stop. You got all that stuff inside. <laughs> Fast food. Man, look at the big tires on that thing. He's definitely an oversized truck. Look at the steer tires on that thing, man. They look painted like super singles. <laughs> what is that thing? A crane? Looks like maybe a crane. It's big. And you stand up real close to it. <laughs> Pretty big. That's what it is. It's a crane. Heavy hauler. Today. What? You wanna come up here? Huh? Hey, what are you doing? Slow down, guys. Jake, Jake, you're like a hundred miles an hour, buddy. You're like a hundred miles an hour, buddy. Hi, Pooh Bear. Did you have a good day today? Hey. Did you? What did you do today? That's right. You slept, ate, and slept some more, huh? Huh? <laughs> and Jake, he's just a hundred mile an hour. Well, get over here. I don't know which way you want to go with this. But anyway, we are done for today. We're going to leave out early. Did I miss any phone calls? Sent you a friend's request. I have to tell you guys. You have prostitutes and lot lizards. Now, there's a new one. I call them Facebook lot lizards. I get so many requests, and don't, don't get me wrong, I mean, they're pretty women. I mean, I'm kind of flattered, but you know, at the same time, I think they do this with all the guys. They want to get to know who I am, and they call me honey, and sweetie, and then a week goes by and they want to know if they can get some money from me. <laughs> me and Rudy was talking about that today matter of fact but here's another request and this one don't even have a picture I'm just kind of curious Tori David and it's not that but she has no she she there's nobody you know she doesn't know anybody Do I accept something like that? Sometimes I do, until the, until they start asking me questions like, "How old are you? Are you married? Do you have kids?" Obviously, they don't watch my channel and they know nothing about me. And they want to know what my real name is. I say Trucker Jukebox. <laughs> I leave my actual name out of it. Um, and sometimes I don't. If you're going to. Uh, friend re request me uh, I, I would prefer that you you do it because of my channel or because you know me and, uh, and not because you're trying to do some s soliciting and trying to pick me up because first of all I don't have time I have a truck that I have to take care of I am out here on the road and I got two dogs I got to take care of so as far as relationships I don't have time for just don't have time for it, you know. And don't get me wrong, guys. I have a girlfriend or two out there, but they know me. I know them. And uh, we'll just leave it at that, you know. So I usually hit delete. They don't know who they are. Now, usually if it's a guy, 
like here's a Richard Muriel. And again, I'm not racist. It's just if this guy says he knows me because of my YouTube channel, or in this case, uh, he's got one new uh, one friend, Husker Power. I don't know who he is, but I doubt if he's going to ask me how old I am. I do I have kids and am I married? <laughs> I'll get at. And some of you guys are going to say, well, that's being racist, ain't it? Uh, no, I, I, I'll friend any lady that's out there. Just don't want to be hit up on, you know, because I don't have time for that. I really don't. But anyway, we are done for today. So we're going to get out of here got to put up a video and uh, get it rendered so you guys can watch it tomorrow. And, uh, then we got to get to bed. 716. So it's still early. If I can get this done, go to bed. And with that being said, somewhere there on the screen, there's a subscribe button. And if you're not subscribed to us, check us out. And if you like it, please uh, subscribe. And if you like our video, please share it. My videos are so basically, it's my daily life as well, and because I drive a truck, 90% of it is because I'm, but uh, when I am off or doing something, I, I still got the cameras up, uh, and uh, every day there's a video, no matter what, and uh, that goes the same if I bump into a subscriber out here or something, of course I'll ask you first, but uh, I would love to get you on camera and say, hey, everybody check this person out, you know. And I am going to request to go up to the Michigan because there's some people up there I want to meet. And uh, that will make it happen. But anyway, with that being said, God bless. Good night. We will see you guys come 4 a.m. tomorrow morning. Later. Who? Cool.